Hello YouTubers, it's Bazone here. I'm playing Factorio. Uh, we got some stuff to get doing. We started off with a furnace and a burner mining drill. It looks like we're, we were lucky really because we got iron, copper, uh, is that man stone? Great. So let me get this. Oh, we didn't start with any iron. That's gonna really suck. We gotta wait for one piece to come. Sometimes it's a bit randomized. Like, I got two chests. But I only got, like, three bullet magazines. It's really different. One piece will do it, basically. So I gotta wait. Yeah, this is gonna take a bit. <laughs> and... And I can put this chest here. Put that back. Put the one piece of coal in there and get a lot more coal. There we go. Let me get like three pieces maybe. There we go. Let that burn a bit. So we'll walk around and load up the map. Trees give you the wooden chests, of course. So there's iron. That's a huge dose of copper, not to mention we have iron up there, stones over there. Question is crude oil, because crude oil, ooh, that stuff makes the best fuel in the game, alright, but it's really used for end game. This is their crude, oh, ah, we found an oil field as well, woo! There's no yields, wow. The yield in these things are zero. Oh, this is gonna suck. They'll still give you oil, but it's ab. Oh wow, it's a lot bigger. They give you absolutely no oil. They give you one per tick, or one every time you set up an oil pump. This one, okay, yeah, good. We got plenty of coal. We're gonna move this and get iron so we can get a pickaxe and set up basically everything else. You can set up an auto coal miner with these drills. I'll show you how to do that. We'll get hopefully one more piece, one more piece. Nope. Pick this up. Pick this up okay let's go over to the iron side real quick put that down put that in there oh I actually have to make this guy so really I have to do oh actually no I don't gotta do this manually it's just gonna hold a lot There we go. Now we got a pickaxe. Which means we can do some better stuff here. So this and this. Is that enough yet to make? So we can make one of these things. This will pull stuff out and put in this chest. But this guy also runs on coal so we gotta go get some stone which is convenient it's right over here <laughs> bang 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 <laughs> my dude's just like wailing on the rocks right now Wait a bit, and pull off. Where's the trees? Oh, they're down here. Okay, good. And 
gonna clear up some trees and get some wood so I can make a lot of wooden chests. Wood really isn't needed late game, it's just something you can, like, you can use it for fuel in the beginning, and you can use it for wooden chests. Okay, that's still going. Okay, we got 15 stone, which means we can do, we can make three stone furnaces, which isn't bad. What I need to do is grab some iron from here, make another one of these, make that. I think I need like, so what, the automated machine is this, you put th this is on the wrong way, this goes here, you have a conveyor belt going around like so. Dang it, I do need another set. You put this like here. And you get um, another one, actually. And then one piece of coal is all you need. Put that in, and the whole machine shall start up. And you can just expand this just by going down or you can go lateral just by rotating the whole design but as like this will request for coal this arm isn't gonna grab it because it did Sometimes the things in this game are a little bit on the dumb side. Now, oh, that's why it wasn't working. It was facing the wrong way. Now I'll grab from here, put, oh, in itself, because it's got to fuel itself. little arm here died get that back up yeah we gotta do some researching electric furnace is like the end goal good thing because they just run on energy yeah fluid oil processing a lot comes out of this <laughs> this thing is gigantic it is huge Anyways, that's good and that's good. How's this going? Even better. Let's see, okay, still got a furnace, so another drill, please. Because really, we're going to be using these furnaces a lot, and all the furnaces the next tier up and so will require stone or stone brick. So you have to make the next tier, which is just cooking stone because you can just use raw stone and go put some in this so we can start stocking up on that and we really don't need copper that's so early except for the circuits because really that's where copper only plays its role in yeah there we go Start stacking up. Do you have another furnace? Yes, I do. So, for instance, this is how you would expand it laterally to show you guys. So, we'll put down another drill here. Feed this around like so. Oh, gonna go like this. Oops, that was misplaced. Put that there, grab, pick this guy up. That, that, and then turn. Next piece should go into the, there we go. 
two machines running, two up, that's good, that's good. Okay, now this should be making a lot more, a lot faster. For instance, these two dudes will kind of going to run out. See that drill. There we go. Oh, yeah, the steam engine in the boiler. That's electric electricity that we can get into probably next episode, but we're not going to do it now. Really, we just want to set up getting on the bit optimized side to where we have iron plates and iron pl pl iron and copper plates just coming out really easily and us not required so hmm, planning so let me make two wooden chests so right here is where I want the iron plates that come out one two three one two three four one, two, three, four, five. Right there. Okay. And really what I'm going to do is this. Here. There we go. Six furnaces. I want a gap between all of them that a bit wrong okay gap gap there you go so now we'll have copper from here come up here in here we'll have iron from here come in here from here in the coal well can we make a splitter no we have to research it what is that here yes it's here so you gotta get a lab up but the thing is labs are energy so I guess we actually will have to get into energy then so we can make a boiler and a steam pump put it in there We actually got to set up a quick, uh, can I not set up one, dang it, hold on. We got to set up a copper mine because I need copper plates. Okay, there we go there. here that and that put that there put that there there go on that there go for that we gotta make an offshore pump okay so we gotta go grab a bit more. There we go, we can make an offshore pump. So this goes right here. That plugs in the back. Offshore pump. We need three more. Something, oh, dang it. Some things in this game run off a of double, some things don't. Then, can we make it? No, we need... Uh, these little arms, I like to replace them with their electric companions. 
they run better. There we go, there's our lab. <laughs> it's a lot to make it. Not to mention we have to make all of the, um, we have to make 20 of these to research it. So I'll just queue it up, right? Underground belt, splitter. Oh, this is automation. Yeah, the long-handed. So we, if we can make 30 of them. So this is your basic form of power. You can make multiple of these things in a line or really any way if you want to. So we need to grab copper. 30 plates. Yeah, we're not going to have 30 plates. Let's come on. Furnace. Faster, please. Faster. Dun, 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 dun. Mm, micro. Go over there and fill this guy back up. Some things in this game you want to, like, let back up. Like, if this chest gets filled by stone, this drill would stop working. But it wouldn't burn through its fuel, which makes it good. Three more. Come on. One. Two. And three. What the fuck? What are we missing on this time? Iron plates. Okay, so we're missing out on its brother. Boom. We just gotta make all the iron gears and actually make the damn thing. Well, that's going. We can, um... Dang it. We need a lot more iron. Because we need to really make belts. And this is going to take a bit. Do I have stone? No, let me go grab 10 pieces of stone. If you get what I'm going to be doing. There we go, 10 pieces. That's one of you. Oh, both. And then that. Then this, then this. Ah. Let me just put this down first. Twenty-two, eight. Yep, same number. Two pumps. So space for a grabber and then a conveyor belt. Then puts into this chest. Same thing here. Yeah, it's gonna get big, and I'm gonna have to end up clearing out this forest. If I do, nah, I'm that forest. I'm probably gonna have to all do by hand, off, or on camera. But I'll end up probably getting like a flamethrower. Just burn the forest. Let me just start that up. See, now this is making energy. This the boiler's cooking. Ten more to go. Well, that goes. Trying to get a lot of iron. Yep, I'm gonna make twenty more gears and twenty transport plates. 
and when the research is done, which it sh when logistics finish, that will be the end of this episode. Not to take up time. I'll probably put this under upload this up and probably hit the hay. There we go. See, in the beginning, it's a lot of moving around and filling machines up. Okay, so those ten are done too. And I'll get to the point where I have um, these science packs auto-made. So I don't have to hand make them, because if I have to hand make them, that's going to take forever to do. So let's see here. Both these will be running in from the sides. So now, yeah, that goes there, and it's a one gap space. Okay. There we go for that. Okay. Ooh, geez. There we go. It's all nice and dandy. We can put poles down the center here for electricity. Um, everything's running good. Okay. Really, it's just going to be a lot of these plates in the early. maybe get some electric poles up so this can be electric with inserters because really being honest here running on coal power is not to my liking And in the end game, like, like there's, as you can see here, there's four types of the thirds packet. My god, is it expensive? Where is it? It's somewhere. Okay, yeah. There. Nope, that's the alien pack. That's not hard. It's just caught requiring you to go kill aliens um plastics no ah it's in batteries yeah look at this one battery which is one iron play one copper play and two sulfuric acid one advanced circuit one smart inserter and one steel ingot steel is what you think you cook you cook an iron plate the next level over. So, yeah. Well, actually, no. This one can run long. This one's right over here. But, actually, really, they b both of these lines got to pick up coal, so the furnaces can grab coal, and they can, um, they can grab coal as well as their ores. 
So the coal p gets put on here. And their ores get put onto these two rows. Oh, here comes the lo lo logistics. And three, two, one, boom. Okay, we'll research automation. Okay, there we go. Let's get a splitter out. Yeah, that kind of expensive. We get the fast insert. Oh my god, that thing it really is fast. Okay. Get this down. A couple more of these. Let me get really in a burner insert because this thing can fuel itself here. Now I just got to see the tracks these things go on. Okay, that's a no-no. That can't go on that side. It has to go on this side. Because if it goes on that side, when the iron gets put on this side, it won't work. This will work. This will not. So, gotta go like that. Okay, when I attach this, this will run all the way down. There we go. These should be put on the far sides. Okay, wow, well, these all just ran out of fuel. Okay. Oh, wow, I didn't know we would get automation down, too. Um, the smart inserter, which is <laughs> the fast inserter and four electrics, god, things. Optics, I'm just, well, we can't really do that, but this is going to end it for this episode. Next time, we will get up automizing this to get these chests filling up with iron and copper ingots. See you guys next time in the next episode. Good.